Hey guys, Tim Mitchell here. Another build a blog series. Today we're going to go over the settings, the general settings of your plugins and your website. Here's our website. I did change the, back, the theme of this website, and that's a good thing about WordPress, is it took me about 15 seconds to click a button that said activate, and now I have a new looking website. So, if any time you don't like it, just change it. So, back to our WP Admin, okay? You got online Tulsa marketing.com forward slash blog forward slash WP Admin. Now, you want to come down to settings, okay? Under the general setting, you want to ch make sure that your site title has your keyword in it. And for this, I'm just targeting uh, Tulsa Internet Marketing Blog, okay? Tulsa Internet Marketing Blog is a tagline. You want to make sure this is something. And so you want to say, and then keep up with all the local marketing news here. I always suggest that you put your phone number. Because that's going to show up in your site as a listing in Google. You won't even have to click your site before they can find your phone number. And so if they want to contact you, done. We'll go over that here in a little bit. Okay? Next thing you're going to do writing you don't really need to worry about anything like this so let's go to privacy you want to say I would like my site to be visible to everyone including search engines make sure this is done otherwise you've just told the spiders not to ever come to your website save permalinks now you want to make a custom structure permalink and it's going to be forward slash percentage post name percentage and what that's going to do is whatever you name your post that's going to be the URL of your of your uh, of that post and you can make that a lot more user friendly about SEO friendly okay so next you want to check out the all-in-one SEO and here is where you just say you can, matter of fact, you can come back to general. Copy your tagline if you, you know. I suggest you just come up with something. This is going to be your home page description. And this is going to be your title tag for your website. Keywords, whatever keywords. So, for example, this website will all hit the the one crazy keyword in Tulsa, which is Tulsa Internet Marketing. We like Tulsa SEO. Click, and then so just enter a few a few uh, few of your keywords that you picked. Oops, I really messed that one up, didn't I? Okay. Now, that's really pretty much it. What it's going to do is it's going to post your title format. It's going to be title tag, blog title, page tag, title, blog title, category title, blog title. And this is just going to take care of it. And that's really all you got to worry about. You can do additional post headers and page headers if you... But really, you've mainly taken care of most of the majority of everything. So, okay, Google Analytics, you want to enable analytics and enter your analytics user ID right here, okay? which I'm not really sure what mine is but you want to make sure that you're taking care of that okay 
and you don't really need to check anything else. Save changes. Oh, it looks like one thing we forgot on all in one SEO. You have to enable it right there at the top. Don't forget that. And now you'll notice that this thing went away. The very big red thing at the top. Sociable. You can go pro on that if you really want to. It's up to you. Um, I'm not going to tell you either way. I'm, I don't. I'll say that. And so you can choose some of the bigger ones here. I like a Mr. Wong uh, LinkedIn because this is going to be, if this was a personal, like, but if it's going to be business related, I think it really would be good if I give somebody the option to do LinkedIn. Okay, you can do, I mean, a ton of these things. You can select all of them if you really wanted to, but there's, it's up to you. And I'll show you where those go in here in a, in a minute. Only wire auto poster. Okay, you want to enter in your only wire username and password. Okay, and if you don't have one, simply go onlywire.com. This is a wonderful service. It's free and paid. They have the free service and they have a paid service. You would just do a sign up rather than a login. Okay. And so you can post here your services. You just go sign up for services. It's all the, you can sign up for all these with a the username and password, and you're good to go. Yeah, this will show you the history. This will show you some of your tags that you've used. Um, some more information on your website. You know your account, your company name, what you do. Okay. And as far as uh, getting your settings set up, that's that's really it. You want to set your akismet if you want to use it. You're going to have to enter an API from a WordPress.com site. Just go to WordPress.com, start a site, and just search, really, just search for your API code. Just type that in, API key, and you'll find the instructions on how to get that. Otherwise, that's all the setups that's really needed. So, with that, I want to say if you're ready to learn to market your business online, with free videos and free reports, go sign up today at OnlineTulsaMarketing.com. Again, that's OnlineTulsaMarketing.com. I offer a ton of free videos, some great reports and guides in, uh, included in that is the remainder of this series on Build a Blog, along with about 20 other videos outside of that, just giving tips, tricks, and how-tos on marketing your business online. OnlineTulsaMarketing.com. Enter your information and I'll talk to you soon.